Hello and welcome to Neighborhood Real Estate Update, where we bring you hyper-local, timely, and accurate information about real estate in zip codes all over San Diego County. Today is June 12, 2023, and we're talking about Mira Mesa. Now, if you live in Mira Mesa and want a no-obligation uh, custom graph that is tailored to uh, your property and your property value, just let us know. We can do that now, and I'm going to show you that a little bit later in the video. We can make all kinds of graphs based on all kinds of data and tailor it to whatever area you want. You want all of Mira Mesa, you want just your neighborhood, you want just your street, and this graph will update in real time. So we only have to send you one link. So that's a new, new thing that we are offering and uh, happy to do it. So let's jump right into Mira Mesa. Let's see here. We are going to have to do one more little thing here before I can... There we go. All right. So first of all, looking at the entire county, this number of homes for sale is as high as it has been since um, I want to say November of last year, maybe October. We are at 2,484. So the number of homes for sale is about to crack 2,500 for the first time in many, many months. Now there are still uh, plenty, of, plenty of pending sales happening. And I believe when we look at Mira Mesa here, we are still gonna see more pending homes than we do uh, active. So uh, this little rise in inventory, while it is welcome, is far from enough to sort of solve what's going on right now for buyers, which is making things very difficult for people to find properties. So let me get myself off of the screen so we can see the numbers. There we go. And let's pull up our comparative market analysis summary so we can buzz through this really quick before we get to our uh, lovely custom InvoSpark charts. All right, so looking at the number of homes for sale, there are 22, which is a bump up from uh, what we saw last month. Uh, so that's good. And the average market time is 47 days, and that is down a bit, although we still have Boy, this house on Rock Canyon Drive that's been hanging around for nearly a year now uh, that is not sold, that's dragging the average up. And then we have a couple of other uh, high market time uh, offenders here. Um, you got an 1,890 square foot home on New Salem Street at 980 that has not sold. Time to get real there. Uh, you know, you price too high, it's just not going to fly. You price it well and it will sell. So 22 active, average market time, 47 days, 31 pending. So that is more pending than active, but not twice as many more like we had uh, last month. So 31 pending, very healthy. And the average market time on the pending is, wow, look at that, 19 days as opposed to 47 on the active. So you really see what happens when you don't have you know a couple that have 300 or 200 days on the market because these homes were priced well to sell and you've got an average market time of 19 days on the pending and then you have 22 sold in the last 30 days uh, with an average market time of 12. man oh man is that quick these are just blazing fast market time uh, average to pending and then the average market time on the uh, closed properties is 12. So that indicates a really fast moving market in Mira Mesa for sure and still more pending than active. Uh, but that uh, active number is creeping up. So let's see what's going on now. Uh, with the uh, list sale price ratio. And this is an example, uh, just one example of uh, charts that we can uh, produce for individual homeowners or just people who are interested in an area. Let's add our area here and let's add uh, 92126. Let's just add the whole zip code. 
because that's what we want to see here. And this is, okay, percent average list price, average of original list price to closed price. In blue here, you have San Diego County, and in orange, you have 92126 Mira Mesa, which you can see is tracking pretty closely to uh, the average in San Diego County. And if we go all the way back here to um, March of 2022, pretty much the peak of the uh, latest market cycle, uh, much, well, in Mira Mesa was, was even better, was outpacing San Diego County with 109.6% on average uh, sale price to original list price. So homeowners were getting on average 10% more than their list price, which is nothing to sneeze at when you're talking about a million dollar house, 10%, uh, that's easy math, that's a uh, hundred grand. So uh, not, not bad. Um, okay, so then at its lowest here in November of 2022, which was the bottom of, uh, bottom of this current uh, trough that we're, that we're seeing here, the, the high and the low, uh, 94%. So uh, homeowners in Mira Mesa had to deal with uh, their neighbors getting 10% over list price to then just a few months later getting 6% uh, less than list price on average. And now we have, uh, we're working our way back up the ladder and we are at 102.3% list to sale price ratio. Now, if you're a homeowner in Mira Mesa, or if you're just somebody who's interested in tracking this, uh, we can create a graph for you. We can uh, tailor the criteria uh, even more. I just have this looking at the entire zip code, all property types, all bedrooms, all stories, all sizes. Uh, we can narrow this down. I can search by a, an area on the map or by the zip code. So I could do uh, just, just your block, just your neighborhood, whatever you want. And once we send you this link, you can follow the link and it will update month after month after month. Uh, we can do original list price to closed. We can do average sale price, market time, uh, on and on and on. Um, here to see, you know, you can see all sorts of different uh, stats about your zip code or your area right here. Now, for instance, let's look at average market time. Right now, uh, 92126, 18 days versus uh, 28 days in San Diego County as a whole. At the peak, it was 45 days, and I believe this is um, on average price on uh, closed properties. Anyway, you can see uh, the types of uh, statistics that we can graph for you. And again, no obligation, custom graph, just let us know, we'd be happy to do it. So that is what's happening in Mira Mesa right now. We'll be back again uh, tomorrow. Yes, probably, yes, tomorrow we'll be back with another uh, neighborhood real estate update. And then uh, Thursday with San Diego Market Watch. So stay tuned for all those. And if you like this content, please remember to like, share, subscribe, and comment. And we will talk to you later.